Hello friends, very good evening. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Talent Traders. Myself Bala here and welcome you all to my channel. And on this session, I'm going to discuss about my Google Sheet uh, for a weekly positional trades. So how many trades which she gets uh, this week and how it is looking. And it's a weekly positional. So this week we have uh, only four days left and a uh, one day holiday. So only four days uh, live session. Tomorrow is the holiday. And those who are following the sheet, it works based on our concept advanced option strategy. And if you want to use your one strategy also, you can apply with your uh, the sheet. And uh, today we find a lot of opportunities uh, and some of the trades which got uh, more than 50% and some stocks which is nearing 10% plus. So if you are using for an intraday basis, we may be trying for uh, the top list of stocks. And if you are looking for a positional and uh, if you know our advanced options concept, you can maybe use it. Or you can also follow with some your techniques like charts and other indicators. You can also run the trade. So here is the scanner which is going to provide you what are the performing stocks in the day or in a week or in a month. So from that stocks, we need to select a quality and liquid stock. That should be better for our uh, trade opportunity. And uh, maybe, uh, you know, well, I have to use the Google Sheet also. And we made a video and that video of course is around the free for this one week. And if you want to access the recording or the link which is available in the description, you can go through it. Okay, so here uh, these are all the stocks in the Indy Copper, Coal India, PFC, MCX. From this list, how many stocks which giving you perfect entry? So what do you mean by the perfect entry with our Google Sheets? So we are not taking entry if the stock triggers before 9.30. Why? Because of most of the stock when it is gap up and gap down, so we may be not getting that stocks. Uh, that means gap of stocks. So that may be open gap up and maybe triggers and reversed uh, back very quickly. So that reason to avoid uh, loss making trades, it's a filter. So we have to, we don't have to take uh, the trades which, which triggers our entry point before 9.30. That is called the uh, fresh break or so we are looking for. So here in the copper, coal, India, PFC, MCX are the stock which triggers and slightly higher. Let me go for a manapuram. 10.5 should be our breakout point on 135. So mostly, uh, sometimes the stock is not liquid. Sometimes it's liquid. You look at this. From the morning, so 9, 9.15, it started 13th November. It has made a high of 5.7. But only that trigger happened on 3.15 to 3.30. So the last 15 minutes, that is a big move, which is happening. It's not about uh, reliable and not... Uh, Good also. We are positional trader. You can look at this more many times. It is a volume, lag of volume, or a no trade happened in this particular strike price. That is the reason. So we need to take before a trade. So we need to check the liquidity and the volume. So maybe if you are watching this stock, so we can't be able to take maybe low liquid. And Sun TV is 645. Let me check 645. So like we have to find a fresh break, or you can see the past 15 minutes candle. That started with 23. The high is made is around 23. But our entry point is around 31.25. So you can see it is trading. And 31.25 may be triggered around 12 o'clock. So after that, it is not a liquid. Uh, 31.31.5. No? So that is 31.2. Maybe at this point only it is triggered around 12 o'clock. But after that, it is not traded. So the liquidity issue. So we don't want to take all the stocks. Let me go for an Indu Copper. Uh, 145 whether it is triggers or not before take that so you need to check whether it is having good liquidity or not and yeah you can see it is traded very well and in the past 15 minutes uh, what is the time 12 15 of 12th november and today 13th november here is the starting one the high which made is around 9.3 our breakout point is around 9.7. So the next candle only it is triggered around 9.30 to 9.45. This is called an oppression breakout which triggers our entry point and on the same day it is achieving more than 50%. Why? Because this is a fresh breakout we are looking out from the sheet. And Coal India 322. So our entry point 17.1. So here is the first candle and the high is around 16.95 never triggers and 17.1 got triggered around 9.45 to 10 o'clock candle and after that it reaching towards our target and it was a quick move and finally it closed but this trade we are planning based on our weekly concept so it is a one week holding 
uh, positional. Okay, but it was giving you an entry day that was good opportunity. And PFC 11 rupees is our entry point. Mostly in the morning, it was not traded PFC 290. Okay, so you can see this is not a fresh breakout. So initially, by starting itself, it went up to 20 rupees and made a high low of 5.95. And after that, it went up to 28. But uh, what is our entry point? PFC is 11 is our entry point. Here in this case, it was moving towards a 20 in the first 15 minutes candle. So maybe a gap up and that our entry point triggered in the first 15 minutes. Simply we can ignore it. Okay. So to avoid some loss making trade, MCX 2600. So one more trade. Uh, in the, this one also looking good around 930, uh, 75. Our entry point is 93. So 93 when it is triggered at this point, no, 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 at 1045 to 11 o'clock candle. So 95 is the high. So we trigger around this point and after that it closed with 129. That was around a 40% increase. Yehu ba 700 call, 28.9. Whether it is giving you opportunity or not, 700 call. Uh, 29, right? So 29, exactly 28.9. So when it is triggered at this time of uh, 10 o'clock okay so this is also be a fresh breakout so sometimes market opens gap higher or gap lower so many trade got triggered so same like in an intraday so if you are looking at the indica for 5.81 that can be not triggered and here you bank 17.8 in intraday we look at this in the first 15 minutes candle it made 22 915 to 930 it is a gap up so we need to find out a stock which not broken that our entry point and it should be break after 9 30 that we called as a fresh breakout and uh, that may be working for us intraday through this works based on the campbell r4 we need to find a right opportunity by using this and one or two opportunity and weekly sheet also we need to plan with one to two trades per uh, week that's good enough i think to this monday the starting of the week we got a more than two or three trades and the you know four or five trades which triggers i'm talking about one year quality and liquid stocks not to talk about all the stocks triggered at 11 from uh, i don't know about a monoprom which is not liquid and bel also we need to check whether it is a liquid or not maybe if bank is liquid and bhel that was high large size uh, maybe a liquid so we need to take the liquidity so but if you are following in the copper and coal india that's good enough for this week and it triggers our entry point and that was giving you such an opportunity as a monthly positional trade, so those who are loan over our advanced subscription strategy, almost uh, we are right now 20, 26, 27 stocks which achieved our target. From this list, we find that already few stocks is not triggered our positional in uh, that means entry not available or entry not given. But remaining 10 to 15 stocks which achieved share targets and then after our entry. So that's good enough for the month of December, sorry, month of November that already done our targets. I hope. Uh, you enjoy it and if you look for the sheet it is a paid one if you want to access the sheet you can uh, get back to me on my whatsapp number which shown on this video i hope you enjoyed this session and weekly positional started and giving you such a good result thank you so much thanks for watching and if you are new to my channel kindly subscribe